Hi everyone and welcome to my What I Got For Christmas video. Today I'm going to show you, well, what I got for Christmas I guess. And um, please don't be offended by what I got, just a general disclaimer. I'm really grateful for everything that I got this Christmas and I just wanted to share it with you as I've really enjoyed what people have been sharing with me, well not generally just me, but the whole YouTube community with their What I Got For Christmas videos as well. So I thought I'd join on the bandwagon. Um, I'm going to start with what I got in my stocking because they're like the smaller things and then kind of work my way up. So if you're not really interested in all the tidbits then skip forward I guess but you know why not stay stay in for the for the game it won't be too long I hope anyway I hope <laughs> okay to start with like most people I always get a majority of my year's worth of socks at Christmas time I got some thick ones like this which are like mountain climbing socks that are, I actually I really like tacking into the top of well obviously wearing all the way up but kind of having a little bit on show and over the top of Ugg boots and these sort of fluffy flip flipper Fluffy flipper socks, fluffy slipper socks, which are really good for um, around the house. Um, um, particularly, I love these, which are actually slipper socks. They've got little bits of plastic at the bottom that's going to be slipping, but these have little pigs at the toe. How cute are they? I love those. They're from my manager, so thank you, Emily. Um, not all the socks, just the pig ones. The other ones are from Santa Claus. Thanks, Mum. Okay. Um, I've got loads of chocolates. I've got chocolate coins. I've got chocolates and tubes. They're from my friend at work. Um, I've got chocolate bars and chocolate bars. <laughs> um, I think people are trying to tell me something. Sorry. Um, I think people are trying to tell me something. And yeah, I love chocolate. White chocolate generally. As you can tell, I had no white chocolate coins. Just some milk chocolate because I ate them all. Oops. Um, I also got... Oh more socks. I also got um, this torch which I probably just blinded you with. Apologies. And I'm sorry for the noise as well on my keys. Actually I really like this torch. You can flash it that way. <laughs> like on a bike. Um, I got some nail files and this little contraption which is meant to keep your headphones kind of in order so they don't get tangled in your bag. Do they keep them untangled in your bag? <laughs> Mine still managed to get out and um, cause a havoc in my bag. Um, I got a zippered, zippered, that's not right, a zebra print pen. You kind of pull it and it's a pen, really cool, um, which I really like. So that'll be going in my pencil case. Um, I got a wonderful tangle teaser. These are one of the new ones. I have the original, um, which is my lifesaver and absolutely adore it. This is one of the new, they're called aqua splashes and they're for the shower so that if they get wet, you can just dry them out and then travel with them straight away, which is the main, my main bugbearer with the original. Like if you have a shower in the morning and you want to travel any time in that day, then you need to put it in a bag because otherwise you'll have it like dripping in your bag the whole way, which is not fun. Um, I got this, which is a little book holder. It's like a little man that you take out or a little lady, I guess, and you kind of slot it in between your pages and it holds kind of the spine of the book, which is really handy. And I read in the bath, so it'll be really useful. Um, and I also got this in my stocking, which is a bit big for my stocking, but hey-ho. It's a um, cupcake cookbook, and it comes with a silicon cake tray, which I've always wanted to try one of these. And so I'm really excited to use it. And yeah, that was my stocking. So thank you, Santa. Um, one of the presents that I got for Christmas that was really special was from my friend Billy from university. Um, she made our group of friends, the th three of us, she made um, key rings for and her her thing is that she really loves cats and all my friends really love cats and they've all got cats. I don't have a cat, I have a dog. But she made me a Maru, um, which is my favourite cat on the internet. Um, it's like a Japanese cat that loves going to boxes. I'll link them in the description box below so you have to watch. Um, this is Maru, my little Maru. It's made out of like the felt material. It's got a little handmade, a little collar, and this is him in a box. It's so cute, and I absolutely love him. He's on my keys, so thank you, Billy. I have two sets of keys, one for home, one for uni, so that's how that's happened. Um, under the tree, I got a Pandora charm from my brother and his family, and it is a dice, which I have on my bracelet right now. So thank you very much to Ron and Julie. I love it very much. Um... I got this from my mum, which is the weirdest present I guess some of you would think. It makes absolute racket, so I won't do it again. It's a flower sifter. 
So you put flour in the top and then instead of having to sieve it, you just kind of trigger it and it will come out without any lumps. Um, I was absolutely fascinated by these when I first saw them in TK Maxx and I was like, oh my God, what is this? And I used to go around doing this and I was like, oh, I need to buy one, I need to buy one. But I didn't get around to it. Not that I need to buy one, I just wanted it because, you know, who doesn't need umpteen um, <laughs> stupid <laughs> kitchen utensils? So she bought me that as a, like a joke. And she also got me this, which is a Taylor Swift album, and I absolutely love Taylor Swift. Like, oh, ever since her first album came out with her really curly hair, and she, was, she had um, Mary on there, and oh, I love that song. I love that album. I was like, oh, this really cool country singer, and oh, I'm gonna be so different and like her, and then she got really mainstream, but I still love her, and as soon as she goes and does this in concert in the UK, I'm definitely gonna be buying a ticket, because I want to see her. Um, I got the Cheryl Cole autobiography because I quite like Cheryl Cole. I think she's really beautiful and actually she's got quite an interesting life. I haven't read much of it at all so far, only up to there, but I'm really enjoying it and I'm, I look forward to reading the rest of it. My brother got me a pair of Ugg shoes. I know people are really iffy about Uggs. I do have Ugg boots. I have five, four, four pairs. I have one pair of shoes like this. They're kind of a tan leather tan suede with no bow on them and I wear them outside. They kind of look like slippers but they're meant to be sort of outdoor shoes and I love them and they look they look like moccasins so that's fine and that's what I'm going to do with these as well apart from their raspberry red and I love them. They look so cute but I don't want to wear them now because England is awful at the moment. It's so wet and just rainy. I don't want to get the suede all mucked up so I'm going to save those until it gets a little bit drier. Um, Next is my big present. So I've had kind of little things um, in my present so far, apart from the Uggs. Next is my big present for my mum, and it is this. And I was not expecting it at all, and it is, hang on, let me just unlock it. An iPad mini. This is me and my boyfriend. <laughs> um, and I love it. I have an iPhone, and I've always wanted an iPad, but I was kind of like, oh, I haven't got that much money anyway, and do I need one? Da -da. So it's that sort of present that I really love to receive, because I wouldn't, I don't know, I would have bought one myself, but very later on when I've graduated and things. But I love it. I've got all the kind of the, well, not all the, I've got some apps on here, and I love it, and oh, I just think it's so fun. There's my dog on there. Um, I watch all my little YouTube videos in here all the time, and it's just so handy, and it fits really well into like, this is just a clutch bag from Gap. Um, I haven't got it in case yet, so if any of you guys know where to get a good case, please let me know. I need to um, get on keeping it safe. Um, at the moment I'm just keeping it in here, but I need to get a protective case for it. But yeah, and then last but not least is a present for my boyfriend, and this is like crazy, and I was not expecting this gift at all. Um, but I went traveling this summer, I went interrailing um, throughout Europe with two of my really good friends. We went through France, um, Spain, Italy, went through Switzerland at one point, <laughs> it was a bit crazy. But um, I really, really, really wanted to go to Rome. But because Rome is so far south in Italy, we didn't have enough time to kind of cross over from Milan, Venice, um, you know, <laughs> traffic where else we went, I can't remember. Um, uh, What was that even called? And Genova. Oh, we didn't have enough time because it's so far south. Um, we went to Genoa, Milan, Venice. It's all kind of northern Italy. And whereas Rome is so far south, we didn't have enough time. And I, I've always wanted to go to Rome. Always wanted to go to Rome, sorry. I live in a Roman town. I love everything Roman. I'm kind of giving it away. <laughs> so my boyfriend booked or well, wrapped this for me and told me that he'd booked a weekend away for us in June so it's gonna be so warm when I get to wear shorts and we're gonna go to Rome and I'm so excited I'm gonna see the Colosseum and we're, li we're living I wish we were living we're staying really close to the Vatican um so I'm so excited and thank you so much Joey oh I'm so excited and yeah I, I was really stunned I was not expecting it at all we kind of set a price limit or he told me to set a price limit for this Christmas did he stick to it no <laughs> so well, but no, I was so lucky this Christmas and I love all of my presents and I'm so excited. So yeah, thank you for watching this video. I hope you made it through. I'm sorry if it was really long. We're going to stop babbling now and we're going to see if I can edit this. So wish me luck. Um, welcome to my new channel. Um, I hope you enjoy the ride as much as I am going to. 
I'm really excited this YouTube thing. It was my New Year's resolutions, but that video is the next one. So <laughs> yeah, I hope you have a lovely day. Please request any videos you'd like to see from me and I hope to see you guys really soon. Lots of love. Bye.